Hi you guys, today I'm going to show you what to do if your AirPods case is flashing white. So have your AirPods with you so you can follow along as we go through. Let's jump right in. So when your AirPods are flashing white like this, this normally means that the AirPod case is pairing and is trying to find a device to pair to. This isn't necessarily a bad thing. If your AirPods aren't connecting to it and your case is continually blinking white like this, it could be a connection issue. Hopefully it's not a hardware issue. If it is, then the only way is to go get them replaced or fixed by Apple support. So the first thing we're going to want to make sure of is that our Bluetooth on our iPhone is on. Obviously, if it's not on, then our AirPods are not going to be able to connect because they, these two connect through Bluetooth. So to make sure that your Bluetooth is on, you're going to launch your settings and you're going to go into your Bluetooth and you'll find your AirPods. In order for the AirPods to be connected, they have to be outside of the case. They should automatically connect, but if they're not, then you'll click on them. They should connect for you. However, if that's still not working, a good way to give your Bluetooth a reset is to just turn it off and on again. So you'll turn your Bluetooth off and you're going to want to wait about 10-15 seconds in between turning it off and on again. Um, this is just going to ensure that it gets that full reset. And you're going to turn it back on and you can try to reconnect your AirPods. Hey, if you're finding this video helpful, hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. This helps the channel to grow and it helps us reach a larger audience. Thanks again and let's get back to the video. The next thing to try, if your AirPods are outside of the case, your Bluetooth is turned on and they're still not connecting, the next thing you're going to want to try is forgetting this device um, on your iPhone and then reconnecting that one. So next to your AirPods, you'll find a little eye icon. You'll click that. And here it's going to bring up all of your AirPods information, including the battery percentages on both the AirPods and the case. Um, and then down at the very bottom, you'll find the forget this device. So you'll forget the device, forget. It's just going to let me know that it's this device is going to be removed from all of my devices signed in to um, my iCloud. So once I forget the device, it will disappear. And then in order to reconnect them, I'm going to want to put the AirPods back into the case with the case head open. And then we're going to press and hold on this button at the back here. Once these are in and I've pressed this button, this is going to pop up on my phone screen asking if these are my AirPods and whether I want to connect to them, which I do. So I'm going to connect and then it's going to prompt me to press and hold that button again. Continue. And then you'll find them at the top, hopefully connected. The next thing you're going to want to do is check your AirPods battery percentage. So if the case or the AirPods themselves are dead, then obviously you're going to find difficulties in connecting these two. And sometimes it can be hard to tell whether your AirPods are dead or not. If you don't know how to do this, it's really simple. You're just going to open up the case and right away your AirPods are going to pop up with the battery information on them. So on the left hand side, we have the average percentage of each AirPod is 99%. And then to the right of this is gonna be the case battery percentage, um, which is at 9% right now. Now, if I wanted to see what each individual AirPod is at, I'm just going to take them out of the case. Once I do this, it's gonna show each individual AirPod um, is at 99% and the other is at 100%. Now the next thing you're going to want to do is restart your phone. It may not be an issue with the AirPods themselves. It could be an issue with your phone. And so restarting it is always a good option. It's the easiest, safest way to fix any issues that are going on in your phone. And to do this, you're just going to press and hold that power button with the volume button um, for a couple of seconds. And then that slide to power off is going to come up. You're going to slide to the right, power it off, and then press and hold that power button again to turn it back on. If you're still having difficulty with connecting your AirPods after the restart, um, the next thing you're going to want to do is check for an update on your phone. If your phone isn't up to date, you might be having trouble connecting to your AirPods for that reason. To check for an update, you're going to go into your settings. And then you're going to go into general and click on software update. And so if you had an update available, it's going to be here. 
where you can actually manually update then and there, or you can click update tonight. Um, you can go into automatic updates and you can just turn on all of these toggles to ensure that if there is an update, your phone is automatically going to update it for you. Another thing to take note of is whether or not your AirPods are authentic or if they are an off-brand um, AirPod. If they're off-brand, then there's a chance that all of the methods I've shown you aren't going to work. Um, and this is an entirely separate problem unrelated to the authentic brand of AirPods. There are ways to check that you do have an authentic pair of AirPods. Um, that I'll make a separate video on that. So go right over to that video if it's up um, and hopefully that information can help you out. And then the very last thing you're going to want to do is contact Apple support. This is the most helpful option in my opinion. Apple support is going to walk you through all of the steps I've shown you and hopefully other ones that I didn't get a chance to show you or didn't know of. Hopefully you have Apple Care on your AirPods and you can get them replaced if they need to be replaced. Otherwise, that's it for today's video. I hope that you found it helpful and that one or all of these methods worked for you. Thanks again and as always, I'll see you guys in the next video.